Hey Shannon, hey Kathy, hey Tony. Everybody, Durin. I'm gonna make a quick brekkie and then take a shower. And I ordered groceries because I'm really craving a sandwich, but I ain't never. Shut up, Jesse. Oh my gosh, you're literally the third person I know that has a dog with one ball. <laughs> Natalie's corgi has one ball. Who else's dog had one ball recently that I was talking to? I don't really know who else right after that, but you're the third person. That shirt is super cute. Thank you. Um, yesterday, should we? Y'all were wilding in the comments on my Doppler video. Trying to scare a bitch or something, I don't know. Um, but <clears throat> we have a star party, Christine. Thank you for your stars. I'm feeling good, girl. But yeah, um, baby pierogi, he was hiding. Let me tell you. Um, I couldn't find him for hours. I mean hours. Up until last night, I don't know what time. Thank you, Becky, for your stars. You guys, we are beating Jess in the star leaderboard, and I like to keep it that way. So check if Facebook has given you free stars. Um, yeah, Melissa, Jesse's dog, and then Cor my friend's or my nephew's girlfriend's corgi has one ball. Um. But I just wanted to hear his little heartbeat. Supporters got to hear it last night. We found it last night. He was hiding. He was low. Very, very, very low. Um, thank you, Sarah, for your stars. Thank you, Leah, for your stars. Thank you, Monica, for your stars. Love you. And um, he, was, he was not having it. <laughs> thank you, Christine. But he was low as heck, and he was hiding, but... We found him last night before bed, and then this morning, I usually check in the mornings if I ever do. But this morning, he was hiding too, and I found him really low. Thank you, Bunny, for your stars. Um, Becky, it's just a short video I posted in Supporters, babe, right after my live in Supporters yesterday. But let me tell you, he's sitting so low, it's crazy. And then also, like, I started, like, looking up, like, the difference and, like, the, because, like, my doctor said that the Doppler can pick up, like, placenta noises versus, like, the baby's heartbeat. And that's how you know when it's um, the placenta or your heartbeat, too. And all of you guys were like, you can't hear your own heartbeat in your stomach. Like, I don't know who told you that, but they fucking lied to you. <laughs> he wasn't up in your belly button. No, he was like way down in there, almost by the hoo-ha. And that's where he was this morning too. Like he sits low and, and you guys, your baby is not going to be in your belly button area this early on. Thank you, Christine, for your stars, my love. Yes, you guys, we are trying to stay up on this leaderboard and continue beating Jess. 
We're kicking her booty. So thank you for the stars. Um, you can also feel it. No. Um, not mine. My, or not the baby's. Mine, yes. <laughs> But yeah, if you look at your stomach, you guys, and you see your stomach moving, that's your heartbeat. <laughs> and like, also, um, the baby's heartbeat sounds like this. Like, it sounds like a galloping horse. Like a galloping horse, okay? Titch, I'm done with you. Um... So I, I like I just went back and like saw all these comments and like your guys' negativity was just not needed. There's no point in you guys making comments like this has taken way too long to find the heartbeat. That is not a good sign. Y'all sent me into an unnecessary anxiety fucking overdrive for no reason. Bonnie, thank you for your stars. Kim, thank you for your stars. Um so yeah. <laughs> If you think you can't hear your own heartbeat in your stomach, then, I mean, that's a you problem, honestly. Um, I hope you do realize that when they check your blood pressure, um, they go based off of your heartbeat, your pulse. That is also, that can also be located right here. The more you know, <laughs> the more you know. So, yeah, food for thought. And then I just want to say, like I said, he was hiding, like... Oh, Stephanie. Congratulations again on your baby. Um, but yeah, he was hiding low. Like, he was so low. And even this morning when I was trying to locate him, because, like, um, I called the doctor and they were, like, trying to explain to me. They're, like, because I was telling them and I was, like, well, I hear the placenta whooshes. And I can catch my heartbeat. But I, like, he's just hiding so much from me. And I know the next time that I go on my doctor's appointment, which is Tuesday, I already told them on the phone to make a note of it, to let me know if, like, my placenta is, like, in the front, whatever the other words for it are. Um, so they're going to look into that for me. I do know that my uterus, the way it was shaped the last time we looked at the V-scan, um, the way my uterus was angled or whatever with the way I was sitting, he couldn't even see the heartbeat either, like with the, ba the way the baby was sitting in my belly. But he sits very, very low. So there's no reason for you guys telling me to check up here or by my belly button because he was literally right there. <laughs> like, and this morning, like I literally couldn't find him either. And then right when I was about to stop, I heard the galloping just for a split second and then he hit again. And I was like, as long as I heard a little bit of the gallop, I'm fine. <clears throat> right, Shauna. Moral of the story, don't go on regular life with a Doppler because you will get annihilated. So, can anyone see me? I see you, Shane, and my love. Um, I am stress-free. I mean, yesterday it got a little weird because... Yeah, Nancy, your heartbeat. Yes, not the baby's. He's already trying to escape, right? I'm like, sir, get up here. <laughs> Quit sitting so low and scaring mom. But yeah, he's just sitting very, very low. Um, and obviously, that'll happen with babies. And they will hide. Um, also, the, doctors, the doctor did confirm because I told him, I said, my mom said that being 15 weeks going into 16 weeks, like that the baby will like tuck its like, knees into it, his his chest and he was like yeah that can happen right now like your baby's bones have densified or whatever word he used like that they have formed and they're like getting denser so like your baby's moving grooving and living his best life in your uterus people need to stop he's fine yeah like all of your guys's comments gave me an unnecessary scare <laughs> so for that one um let me sleep mom yeah but yesterday we had a little bit of uh juice before going to bed 
and after a while we did find him and then like i said this morning i caught like the galloping two or three times and he was back in hiding way way low down there and i was like okay well i heard the galloping so i know you're in there somewhere The twin was hiding the whole time. What? That's crazy, Kim. Robin, I'm not stressed, girl. Yesterday was a little bit, but it's okay. Hi, Allie. <clears throat> No, Tina, I don't feel him bopping around yet. I know, Gina, but nobody was listening. <laughs> right, Kathy. Living his best life, he is. Hi, Kelly. I see you, Carlino. So, just an FYI. So, everyone that was like, there he is, there he is, there he is. That was my heartbeat. You guys were all screaming, there he is, too. And trust me, when I first did it, I thought my heartbeat was the baby, too. I know, Barbara. Like, I thought it was my, like the baby, I thought my heartbeat was the baby's too, until I heard his actual heartbeat on the ultrasound and then um, on the Doppler. And it literally sounds like a galloping horse, like, like it's fast. Rachel, you'll have to watch the replay. No, Michelle, I don't know any of that. Hi, Leslie. Also, I asked the doctor, I was like, is it normal to have bleeding gums? He was like, yes. Like at night when I go to brush my teeth, and my gums don't bleed when I brush my teeth. When I used to floss, they did before I got like my dental um, hygiene under control and like started learning how to do it properly and started using the flosser, like the water flosser. But he was like, it's totally normal for your gums to bleed too. And I have nosebleeds. Not horrible nosebleeds, but like I wake up in the morning and I have like boogies that are like bloody. Addie, you can message me, my love. I don't have it copied and pasted. It's like, oh yeah, there it is. Right. Oh, Kiera, hugs, girl. Uh, Tammy, you can order it on Amazon. Thank you, Sarah, for your stars. Oh my gosh, Ali, that's so funny. Yeah, like, it's like, it sounds like a, like a, like, I don't know how to explain it. It's like a, like, I could play you guys the recording from this morning, but like I said, I only literally caught him for like, two seconds recording and then he was gone and i was like okay well i heard you so i know you're somewhere in there somewhere over the rainbow he just wants me to hold this damn toy watch so we can hump it fetch with it right now how sad what what's sad girl 
You too, Amy. I don't understand what's sad. Homegirl. Ooh, Addie, thank you for your stars, my love. Bernadette. Someone had a problem with their pregnancy. Oh. Kim, you're new. You have a two years following badge. <laughs> Hi. How are you, my love? I guess I need to wash a mug. No, Nina. I'm staying where I'm at. My family lives in Ohio. I'm in Alabama. Alabama. Karen, the houses that I want go off the market so quick. I have to file this year's taxes too. Yes, Christine, you can. Oh, where's my cheesecake pie? I'm good, Kim. How are you? Thank you, Sarah. Oh, Sarah subscribed. Welcome. Michael, I'm going to kick your ass. Yeah, I don't, I don't want to live in Ohio, so I don't see the point of me moving back home. Uh, Linda, I caught up on all my messages this morning. Did you send it just now? Kelly, I got a bunch of packages yesterday. Yeah, Marie, it sounds like a galloping horse. Yes. Um, Titch, it's because it's private. I marked it as private. It's a little overwhelming with how much love we're, we're getting. I'm like, every day I'm like, oh my gosh. Lisa, get it, girl. It's the best thing ever. Don, uh, yeah, told me that baby is the size of an avocado. The weather, Holly, and the beaches. Hello, Charlene. It's okay, Titch. drop like cream cheese on the floor or something? Why are you licking off the floor, bro? Huh? But yeah, I instacarted supplies for a sub sandwich I want to make. I don't know why people hype up Publix sub sandwiches, but that shit tasted just like Subway to me. Oh, Linda, re-message me then.
Um, Abrina, girl, move the fuck. Who am I marrying, Sherry? Your husband? Can I get a gift, please? Um, like off the registry? You can message me for the registry, my love. I don't know who I'll be marrying, but sure, girl. Hi, Nicole. Yeah, Sarah, you can message me for the registry, then. There's nothing at my door, babe. It must have been delivered to my mailbox. I'll be checking my mailbox before I go and do another unboxing. But there's nothing on my door. Yes, I have to move. I know, Marie. Y'all yeah, get rain 24-7, it seems like. apart sheesh yay Tammy I'm so excited to see what it looks like thank you what do you have to move I need room for me and baby here Lisa Baby's fine, yes. Hi, Paula. Hi, Deb. I see you, Maribel. So that's our breakfast. We added animals with our prenatals and aspirin. And then a bagel with three strawberries. <laughs> He's good, Gina. He likes to cuddle all the time in bed. I want kisses. Kisses. I want kisses. Give me kiss. Thank you. You're such a good boy. You're such a good boy. You're such a good boy. Mama's got to eat her breakfast. Ow. Tracy, if I didn't respond to it, I didn't see it, babe. Okay. I don't know. My mom had us like 38, I think. She's 68 now. So yeah, 38. Before Anita. Yesterday was her birthday, so she's going to deserve that. Make sure she has two. <laughs> oh, Tracy, I did see the comment about the third grandbaby. I said congratulations. Hi, Monique. No, Rachel, waiting on availability. All right, y'all, I'm jumping up here so I can eat. I appreciate you guys, and I will see y'all here in a little bit. Peace out, Girl Scouts. Bye.